Hey guys, welcome to Jay's Calming Corner. Today, I thought it would be fun to read the Blue Day book. So, um, if you just saw my recent video, I did kind of more of a vlog style, and I talked about news reporter coming over and talking about how ASMR can help with depression. So, I thought how fitting my new blue background that I have up and that I have this book the Blue Day book. So it's a cute little one with animals. And uh, I hope you guys will like it as much as I do. Let me go ahead and show you. All right, so here is the Blue Day book. A lesson in cheering yourself up by Bradley Trevor Grieve, who happens to be a New York Times bestselling author. I've had this book for a few years, and when I get it out, it always brings a smile to my face, and it's also very relatable, so I hope you enjoy it too. The Blue Day Book. Everybody has blue days. These are miserable days when you feel lousy, grumpy, lonely, and utterly exhausted. Days when you feel small and insignificant, and when everything seems just out of reach. You can't rise to the occasion. Just getting started seems impossible. On blue days, you can become paranoid that everyone is out to get you. This is not always such a bad thing. You feel frustrated and anxious, which can induce a nail-biting frenzy that can escalate into a triple chocolate mud cake eating frenzy in the blink of an eye. On blue days, you feel like you're floating in an ocean of sadness. You're about to burst into tears at any moment and you don't even know why. Ultimately, you feel like you're wandering through life without a purpose. You're not sure how much longer you can hang on. And you feel like shouting, will someone please shoot me? It doesn't take much to bring on a blue day. You might just wake up not feeling or looking your best. Find some new wrinkles. In my case, it's maybe white hairs. Put on a little weight, or get a huge pimple on your nose. You could forget your date's name, or have an embarrassing photograph published. You might get dumped, divorced, or fired. Make a fool of yourself in public. Be afflicted with a demeaning nickname, or just have a plain old bad hair day. Maybe work is a pain in the butt. You are under major pressure to fill someone else's shoes. Your boss is picking on you, and everyone in the office is driving you crazy. You might have a splitting headache or a slipped disc. Bad breath. Toothache, chronic gas, dry lips, or a nasty ingrown toenail. Whatever the reason, you are convinced that someone up there doesn't like you. Oh, what to do, what to do? Well, if you're like most people, 
you'll hide behind a flimsy belief that everything will sort itself out. And you'll spend the rest of your life looking over your shoulder and waiting for everything to go wrong all over again, all the while becoming crusty and cynical. Or a pathetic, sniveling victim. Until you get so depressed that you lie down and beg the earth to swallow you up. Or, even worse, become addicted to Billy Joel songs. This is crazy, because you're only young once, and you're never old twice. Who knows what fantastic things are in store just around the corner. After all, the world is full of amazing discoveries, things you can't even imagine now. There are delicious happy sniffs and scrumptious snacks to share. Hey, you might end up fabulously rich, or even become a huge superstar one day. Sounds good, doesn't it? But wait, there's more. There are handstands and games to play. And yoga and karaoke. and wild, crazy, bohemian dancing. But best of all, there's romance. Which means long, dreamy stares, whispering sweet nothings, cuddles, smooches, more smooches, and even more smooches. So how can you find that blissful, just sliding into a hot bubble bath kind of feeling? It's easy. First, stop slinking away from all those nagging issues. It's time to face the music. Now just relax, take some deep breaths, in through the nose and out through the mouth. Try to meditate if you can. I think we should take a break and do that. So in through the nose out through the mouth. I know I could benefit greatly from more breathing exercises when I'm stressed. Or go for a walk to clear your head. Accept the fact that you'll have to let go of some emotional baggage. Try seeing things from a different perspective. Maybe you're actually the one at fault. If that's the case, be big enough to say you're sorry. It's never too late to do this. If someone else is doing the wrong thing, stand up tall and say, that's not all right. That's not right and I won't stand for it. It's okay to be forceful. It's rarely okay to blow raspberries. Be proud of who you are. Don't lose the ability to laugh at yourself. This is a lot easier when you associate with positive people. Live every day as if it were your last, because one day it will be. Don't be afraid to bite off more than you can chew. Take big risks. Never hang back. Get out there and go for it. After all, isn't that what life is all about? I think so too. So that is the Blue Day book. So I hope you enjoyed this silly cute little book as much as I did. Some good advice. Make sure to live life to the fullest. Um, you know, chasing happiness sometimes doesn't get us where we need to be. Some things do sort themselves out, but a lot of things we do have to work for. There's a whole lot we can learn in this life, <laughs> and I'm still working on it. I don't think I've ever shared with you guys, but um, one thing that I would love to do is 
to go back to school. I'm planning on it. I'm working towards it and going back and getting my degree in psychology to become a counselor because I know that I've personally found it very helpful. Um, how to get those perspectives and coping techniques and mechanisms and, and all that great stuff. So anyway, thank you so much for joining me. And if you have any other maybe favorite books um, or other requests, let me know in the comments down below. I've got a whole bunch of different videos, so make sure to check those out. I've got some linked here and down below. So have a wonderful rest of your day. And if you're having a blue day, I hope it gets much, much better for you. Bye.